Otto, you're with me. All right, then. Where do we find this stardust, and how will we know it when we see it? There's a river that runs through the southern reaches of the Velcroy. It's the black sand that washes up on its banks that you're after. And I'm guessing you'll be needing sack loads of the stuff. Might be worth our importers and the Dalimil Inn. I'll head down there. See about finding us a wagon. All right. I'll meet you by the river. You two take care, eh? I'll go and see the supplier. Just don't let the bastard fleece you, eh? Ah, he wouldn't do that. He's Blackthorn's mate. Isn't he? <laughs> Best of luck. Looks like I found the river. Now where's Otto? He deserve a rest. Otto, sorry I'm late. Oh, Clive. I had a quick scout about. And I reckon this area is our best bet. Seems Blackthorn's the only one who thinks smithing with his stardust stuff's a good idea. It's just lying here, waiting for any old fool to fill his boots. But unlike any old fool, you thought to bring a wagon. Well spotted. Now get filling. Stardust. <laughs> it just looks like black sand to me. Should be enough for now. Let's see how Otto's getting on. How much did you get? Enough. I hope. together and I can't see Blackthorn complaining. March. Here, Clyde. Do you fancy a walk? It's 
Sid would be proud. Of what? Of you, you idiot. The way you've carried on what he started. When we first met, I had you down as a spoilt little puppy who enjoyed nothing more than biting the hand that fed you. But five years on, you're the one doing the feeding. So thanks for proving me wrong. You weren't wrong. But I changed. Thanks to Sid. And thanks to you. When I suggested taking on his name, you were the first to back me. And if you hadn't, no one else would have. I couldn't have done any of this without you, Otto. Don't give over. You're making me blush. All I did was choose hope over despair. I gave you a chance, yes. But you're the one who took it. You took a rabble of homeless, hopeless outcasts and put them back on their feet. Gave them something worth fighting for, just like the old Sid did. That time I was heading back, I reckon. All this scrabbling about in the sands taking its toll on the old pins. I'll see you back at the hideaway then. You can take a well earned rest when you get there. Oh, I plan to. Believe you me. But I'll make sure Blackthorn gets his precious black sand before I put my feet up. He'll only moan otherwise. Right. Ready to go home, boy? Let's hope this is all Blackthorn needs. Blackthorn, got everything you need? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Cheers for the Stardust. Should be enough to be getting on with. Nice to get out and about for once. Do it again sometime, eh? I'll make a start on putting this thermal plating together, then. It will take some time, mind. So if you've got other things to be getting on with, I could do without you breathing down my neck. Thank you, Blackthorn. I'll let Mid know construction's underway.